So today we're doing a Fisher Lake loop and if you can see we're parking near the stables at Rockwood Park. It's really easy to find. Two roads diverged in a wood and I. I took the one. Cars go to the right so let's go to the left. Everything is probably going to be paved today. Oh well, let's see how pretty it is. At least we're going off of the road along this path and already we get to see this gorgeous view. This is definitely a great spot to stop and take some photos with your family. Well worth it and it's like seconds from the parking spot. Look at the scenery. Fisher Lakes. I'm not tired but this would be a good place to stop and have a little snack and look at the lakes. The man-made lakes, Fisher Lakes in Rockwood Park. Now we're passing the man-made beaches on the man-made lakes and they are manned in the summer for swimming, which is great. They're especially popular in June and early July when there's no danger from those little ducks that we see ahead. The ducks are the only ones swimming today. Hello ducks! Are you enjoying your swim? I'll see you next spring. Here is the old canteen. I don't know if they still open it, but it used to have popcorn that would burn my lips. It was so salty. It was delicious. And porta potties. Always important to know where you can go. Hi duckies! Look at all the ducks. When they're not at Lily Lake, this is where they are. At Fisher Lakes. The trail in all trails doesn't take you this way, but it seems the easiest way to get back on the trail, just behind this clump of trees. And then you go in through here, where they have an access road to clearing the trail. So I think you're supposed to enter it just behind, but it, it's really just too messy to find. There are some great nooks and crannies for family photos. Again, not a lot of shade and most of it is paved. We're completely off the trail in all trails. So we're just gonna go to the right and see if that gets us back. We just are not being true to the all trails experience because the trails aren't clearly indicated as they were in the Irving Nature Park and Sheldon Point Trail. So. It'll be fine, as long as we get home, right? Curves quite a bit, and then it's a little bit rockier here. So just take tiny steps when you need them. Another split, so we are going to head to the right again. And here we go. Now we're getting a little bit of shade. Not a lot, but a little. I'm glad it's early morning. So I actually just slipped and fell. It's very muddy and I just slipped. I didn't do anything special. I just slipped, went over my ankle and down I went. So it's all good, but be careful. Don't slip and fall like me. It's so pretty. Can you see the lake? It may take a little longer than the time. All trails a lot because you just want to stop and look at everything. Grandma Rossi, look, there's your birch trees. Squishy, sloppy mud. And now some rocks. You have to pay attention on this trail. Trees for grandma. So I know a whole bunch of my friends are going to be calling me out on my statement, there's your birch trees. Um, it is slang. You understand my meaning. And it is okay if the verb does not agree. So even though I teach writing, it's not talking. It's okay to use slang when you're just being casual. Grandma, there are your birch trees. But it's 
It's just not as light and slippy. This is how close Sadie walks to me the entire time. Right, Sadie? I love coming around Ben's. It's so beautiful. And if you have time, you can go up and look at the horses and go down there and there's a wonderful playground that we'll visit another day. So while I'd say that the all trails isn't, uh, isn't so good, absolutely hit Rockwood Park. It's so ridiculously beautiful. You, you won't regret it.